thank you for joining me again today for another demonstration. We're going to be using the gel press again uh, and this time we're going to be using colour box. This is lemonade. So I've got my Brea here and I'm just going to transfer this ink over onto the gel press. Again, you don't have to use this size, you can use whatever size you have in the way of um, gel press or jelly, jelly plate. So, ink up, and we're just transferring that ink over onto the gel press. And then taking our brushes and our fan brush. I'm going to pick out the, this is the lemon. And then we've got moss green. And we've got olive green. So I'm sticking with the, the greens and the yellows for this. Okay, so taking uh, some multifarious card, I'm going to pop that down and this uh, piece of perspex is great. This is uh, this is what we use for stamping on some of our larger stamps. So you can get this on the website, but it's designed by All and Create. So I'm just going to bob that down and give it a little bit of a press, and let's see what we've got. Wow, it always amazes me, this technique. I never get bored of it because each, each impression that comes off the gel press is completely different. So uh, you'd never get bored of this technique. Okay, so I'm going to stamp our fairy hive. So I'm going to use the Nocturne Versafine. So simply just ink up. Make sure that you have that whole area covered. And then we're going to just place that down like so. And then give that a good press. It's got quite a lot of detail on this stamp so give it a little bit of time just to soak into the card and bring out that lovely detail. Okay, and there we have it. I'm going to use some of our mini stamps just to build up a little bit of foliage at the top there. So I'm going to use the warm breeze. And I'll start at the top. Now I'm going to move on to the twilight. I'm 
Okay. So I've got a little berry stamp here and I'm going to ink up in Glamorous. And I'm just going to pop a few of the berries around. Okay. And now I've got our little I forget what they're called actually, these come in a set um, and we've got one large and one small so they're almost like little fairy hives themselves but they're, they come in in a pack of two and they're really tiny but they're great I'll show you now if you wanted to just hang them off somewhere put one down here as well and then taking the small one but they're just just a little bit of fun really but they look fab, don't they, hanging off that? Okay. So I'm going to use the twilight again, and this time with a smoothie, and I'm going to go around the edge of the card. Add a little bit more depth at the top here. Making it look quite dense. So it's full of foliage at the top there. Okay. Now I think it'd be nice to have something down at the bottom here. Maybe a little bit of ivy actually. So I'm going to go back to the warm breeze. Just going to pop a little bit of ivy down at the bottom here. Okay. And lastly, I'm going to put some words around the edge. And we'll use the twilight and I'm going to take that first impression off just so that it's not too strong And that's just enough. I'm going to take the um, jelly roll pen that I've got here, the white, and I'm just going to add the white in the windows here.
and we'll do it in the little tiny hives as well just like they've got their lights on so if someone is at home okay And lastly, I'm going to just bring in a little bit of colour on the um, hive itself. I'm just adding a little bit of shading, that's all. And this just makes it look a little bit more three-dimensional. So I'm just using a fine paintbrush here. And just by going around the edge, just makes it stand out that much more. And then I'm going to add just a little bit of glitter. Now this is my glue pen. So I'm just going to dot a little over the roof and going up the stem I only want a little bit I don't want it to be too overpowering okay so let's have a look which colour will go with the, um, the blue and the green glitter and just sprinkle that over the top it's literally just a dusting and there we have it well I hope you enjoyed that demonstration guys thanks so much for joining me again you take care and we'll see you real soon bye for now